Suburban Propane's Ask the Weather Team Night. And the question of the night, one we have done before and one I will likely do again as we get deeper into the cold season. Chris from Saratoga Springs wants to know what the difference is between snow, sleet, and freezing rain, how the various precipitation uh, types tend to come together. Well, snow is an obvious one, and that's when the atmosphere is below freezing from top to bottom. So when precipitation forms in an atmosphere like that, we get snow. We get sleet when a wedge of warm air comes in through the mid-levels of the atmosphere, deep enough so that as precipitation forms as snow and then falls into the warm layer, it melts into rain. But then below that warm layer, we have a sufficiently deep layer of sub-freezing air so that rain then freezes back into the ice pellets that we have. So that is sleet, which is very different from freezing rain. Freezing rain happens, similar scenario, except the warm layer is much, much deeper, leaving only a very shallow layer of sub-freezing air near the ground. So initially we get snow, falls into the warm layer, that melts it into rain, but because the cold layer is so shallow, that rain does not have enough time to refreeze into the ice pellets or the sleet. Instead, it will freeze on surfaces that are below freezing. So the trees, the roads, your sidewalks, things like that will glaze over. So that is just pure rain that happens to fall on sub-freezing surfaces, and that is freezing rain. Again, very different from sleet. So it's a good question. It's one, again, we're probably going to look at it. Never hurts to know the difference between the precipitation types. I know there's a lot of confusion. Some people think sleet and freezing rain are the same thing, and they're not. So when we're forecasting that, it's good to understand how that actually comes together. If you'd like to ask the weather team a question, best way to do it is go to the website, cbs6albany.com, go to the weather section, then click on the Ask the Weather Team link and submit your question there. I just feel bad for those poor decimated trees in your graphic. <laughs> Didn't right? look good. It was it's not a rough a good life scene. For those guys. Well, remember 2008? I mean, the major ice storm when we, in yeah. fact, did have decimated trees. That's so, December, freezing yeah. rain can be a really nasty thing when you get a lot of it over an extended period of time. And we hope that will not happen this winter. And now we'll know it when we see it. Yeah. Yes. Indeed. Falls to you. All, All right. right. Thank you, Thanks, Steve. Steve.